What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Keita Freak. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, because it's free. Nigga, we got Inside Devin Haney versus Ryan Garcia. You know what I'm saying? Family Affair, episode four. Now, if y'all don't know, I've been watching these hoes like a movie, because these bitches have been like a movie, bro. You feel me? Y'all fuck with these motherfuckers. First thing first. Nigga, bro, a nigga, do y'all not know, bro? If y'all go look at my last reaction, it put the Celtics game. I laugh at comments, bro, like this, bro. The nigga said... Bro, you ain't gotta lie, acting like you better on the game. We know you broke, bro. You ain't gotta act like you did. Man, nigga, shut your ass up, nigga. I, I be laughing at comments like that. I don't take them serious, bro. But I be thinking they bots. The nigga said I um that he know I'm broke. Um, I'm lying like every other YouTuber, acting like I'm better on the game. Be original, nigga. I fucking bet it on the Celtics last year, my nigga. If you know, you know. If you don't, get the fuck off my channel, you bitch ass nigga. You a bitch ass neck. Hey, you talking about that first name first, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I just had to address that, get that nigga out, but I ain't even gonna say what I made this year, my nigga. I mean what I made this week, but my nigga, I'm not broke, bro. <laughs> Definitely not broke, bro. I ain't think I'll afford this PC and shit. But um first name first though. Make sure y'all like the video, subscribe if you new. Uh Cairo, I'm gonna come with that. You'll see next. Um I'm about to go ahead and react to that. Uh but just make sure you know what I'm saying. Y'all, y'all share this shit with your friends, your auntie, your cousin, and let them know Kitty Freak taking over YouTube, man. You know what I'm saying? We gotta get back right, bro. You gotta get back right. I do this shit for my fam. I do this shit for my game. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Today is a, just a light light media workout. There's a lot of media in town for um the fight this weekend. I feel amazing. I feel good mentally, physically. 13 round sparring yesterday, so uh, I'm, in, I'm in great shape. I'm excited. They mean to fight this weekend, fight. nigga. Don't that nigga fight? Uh, now we just making every day count. Only found a 20th, uh, nigga. Am I tripping? The founder of Fight Up TV. It's a big fight, man. It's a big fight. You talking about somebody else's fight? Because of uh, Ryan's uh, antics and how he sold the fight, but there's a lot of people talking about it, that's for sure. And this is something a long time in the making. If you followed the careers of Devin, uh, career of Ryan growing up uh, from the amateurs up until now, you know, they have a storied history and they're really familiar with each other. So it's kind of like the ending of that story, that rivalry between them. How confident are you the fight is going to happen? That's the question I'm asked all the time. <laughs> now, I'm very confident that the fight is going to happen. Um, you know, we, we both signed contracts, fight is on, Ryan's training, I'm training. Um, I have no, you know, no doubt that the fight's going to happen. I'm not gonna say at a time did I did, did I did I have any doubts? Yeah, absolutely. But um, you know, Ryan seems like he's he's training and uh, you know he's motivated to fight. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Nothing better happen with these niggas back out this fight. It's no it's no backing out, bro. Contracts have been signed, niggas have been training. It's no way you can back out this shit, bro. It's no way. You're done. You back out, you're done. Career's over. Just hang it up, bro. You know what I'm saying? Devin got an impressive sheet, like I said, bro. Um, but you know, Tank got the best one of all though. Um, Garcia, you ain't fight nobody really but Tank, bro. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. You know what I'm saying? But um, you be knocking shit though. And uh, I've, I've been training. I've been motivated to fight. And uh, it's gonna happen. What Devin, difference is that you seen this time around? Bro, so right up in that chat, man. Uh, yeah, I'm getting stronger. I'm getting stronger. Um, you know, again. And then all this media around, bro. You know how you get, bro, camera just right in your face, nigga. You gotta got down. God, I gang shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to knock the nigga ass out. You feel me? <laughs> like, bro, you gotta gotta really like sell yourself, bro. You know what I'm saying? As a as a fighter, nigga, and you gotta got down. Be humble at the same time. Me personally, my nigga, I, I think Devin winning this shit. I really do. Yesterday, I boxed 13 rounds. So. I ain't boxed 13 rounds since I was like a kid. In this heat? Huh? In this heat? Yeah, in this heat. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, nah, it was literally this hot too. Did you? Um, yeah, but um, yeah. If you are not here with Devin Haney Promotions Management Team, it is time to exit. We appreciate you all for coming, but media day is now over. Please make your way to the door. We train with the heater because it helps cut weight without putting on the uh, sweat bag. The heater makes you just drain all the water out. That bag, like, it's like dehydrates you. It, it takes, like, all, everything out of it. The heater doesn't do that. It just come out natural. 
bro. Yeah, uh, they got a heater and a freezer, nigga. The freezer two, shit. Just give me the two or better, because you can slide off if you violate. Look for it. <laughs> Bullying. Stay close. Nice champ, that's how you call getting down. That's getting down. Breaking hook, short, nice and short, nice and short. Look at them boy, them boy, nice looking boy, short. they looking boy. Good. Ooh. Why I'm back with that jab? Break I down. told you, yep. told you. Good job. You down, you down. I and told good. you. You got the best feet in the business, champ. Keep you. There you go, there you go. Keep using your feet, champ. You got it. There you go, man. Man, show the shit. 69. Great. <laughs> The camera on that man, man. Show the guy down. Sorry, nigga. He was fidgety. You still had it up at 69. He turned it. He turned it up. He tried to slow it down. He tried to slow it down. That's not at their pace. We're four weeks out now. Getting those rounds in. Now I'm Charleston tomorrow. Uh, honestly, the most motivated I've seen them for a camp. So I'm excited for April the 20th. I think it'll be. Shocking performance for most. Get back up around 80 something. <laughs> Two on both sides. And just work on it. No lie, but I can't wait to April 20th either. Hey, time you know, I'm watching that shit. Beautiful. You just take away the counter by being low. Stay close. Keep your head off the line after you're done. Nice. <laughs> Ooh. Line is up. Good. Good. That's nothing. We gotta be first and last. Good. good. I know they don't want to show too much. That's why they ain't showing it. You little and tight. Kind of smart. You little and tight. Bring that hook back. You gotta stop it. Get strong. Way to get down. There you go. Nice. There we go. Good position, champ. Time. 72. 72. Good job. Good job. I would hate to be Derrick James and Ryan because there's nothing he can do. He's going to get steamrolled and stomped on him. That's just what it is. And either they're going to pull him out the corner or he's going to quit on his stool or Devin's going to send him home early and put him in. Now we got to see Devin and Tank, bro. We got to see that shit, bro. You, he will not see the end of the 12th round. Tank too strong for him, though, I feel like, bro. I really do feel like Tank just too much. got too much power for him. I need that every time. I don't mean to Tank fast, too. Inside the ring, is super focused and super sharp. He's dominating. He's doing what he want to do. He's picking the shots. He's, he's, he's getting in and out without barely getting touched. He's on top of his game. Man. Let's go. Kick his. Kick his. That's the key, boy. Up, oh, I thought I know that, bro. If your, if your opponent can't hit you, bro, they can't win, bro. I don't think niggas be knowing that shit. Nigga, all these boxers be thinking they doing some shit by just brushing the nigga and shit, bro. If the nigga can't hit you when you counter him, he can't win. It's impossible, bro. He's not winning. Jabs, I love the way that you stayed your composure. You didn't try to bite right back. You stayed, you stayed in your lane. Come on. Good defense. Oh, that's some new shit right there. What the hell is that? I thought he was going out. Oh. Dude, man, right on the Look at him, they beating the man to the pole, but niggas in that bitch. Oh, 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 oh. That nigga in the ring getting killed. He's like, help me, help me. These niggas just in that bitch. There you go. Oh, good job. Good job. 84. Good job. 84. Good work, good work. 84. 84, good work, good work. Beautiful. 84. Good work. Beautiful. He's looking amazing, you know. um sharp strong fast locked in um i think this is gonna be another one of them ones you know the, the, the regis progress was you know my opinion his best performance but i think this one's gonna top that so i mean you know he's he's dialed in i mean oh that nigga swallowed the hell ain't he i'm looking forward to it i can't wait 35 degree run up to mount charleston as you see it's an ugly day a little hail coming down but uh you know champ working don't want to do it it's raining Snowing again. It's mandatory. It's mandatory. It's not an option. That boy in the field with the hill, nigga. That nigga said it ain't an option, nigga. Bro, watch out for this, nigga.
That's about how they like include different angles, bro. I swear, bro. It's like editing be the best parts of, of videos, bro. Like the editing shit, bro. It really can make a video game, like for real, bro. Man, he ran up this month fast. 44 minutes for the great Devin Haney on Mount Charleston, Saturday, March 23rd, as we prepare for Ryan Garcia 420, smoke out day. Why am I finna, <laughs> fuck am I finna sneeze for, man? Knockout day, Ryan Garcia is going down. Today was a snow day. You know, two kids, the good kids, go to, go to school on, on snow days. The bad kids, stay home. Eat junk food, chill, watch TV, play Call of Duty. I'm a good kid. I go to work. Snow days, rain days, even even off days. I be there just me and a teacher. That nigga lip bro, but that nigga ain't finna start uh -huh. drooling and shit, nigga. Wipe your lip off, nigga. I see you, bro. That nigga look like he hurt. I keep coming back, I keep coming back, making a little progress, a little progress, and get what? We make it out that she love me again. <laughs> 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 Two clicks. Up, get she executive protection. Nigga little white as hell. Ah, damn, look at that boy look, boy. God damn, boy. Ah, uh, damn, boy. <laughs> boy, your ass needs some goddamn. Just that nigga, nigga, got in the field work now, get no fucks. I ain't gonna lie, my shit probably look just like that. <laughs> no cap. Nigga can't feel his lips, bro. This nigga shit frozen, bro. No no funny shit. Nigga, why, why that nigga talking like that? that nigga shit frozen, gang. No, no. What was, what was that? <laughs> My name is Vanessa Lockwood, and I'm Devin's physiotherapist. Chance traps and his uh, fascia. Oh, you need this shit. So we're gonna do a little cooking today to loosen it up and get everything flowing. We're just gonna see, like, the niggas gotta do all this shit, boy. Something for real. Every camp is very amazing because I've worked with a lot of boxers, a lot of athletes where they reach a level and then they plateau where Devin every camp he's adding something new every camp and they're gonna see it's gonna be a showstopper artist artist is for you know the world to see how great Devin Haney is the 20th live on his own which the world is but hey y'all so he still got room for improvement bro see Garcia y'all too though proud of my brother man he keeps getting better they did different fighters though every day but the work ethic that's in him, he deserves everything he gets so I'm just proud of him and I look forward to what what's to come from all the hard work that we got to put in store more. We did. Well what what you see with Devin is a, a real professional. Uh, someone that goes in there and he, he executes a, a complete game plan. And when he handicaps a fighter, he sticks to it. So if we see the weakness and we can handicap you, for sure we're going to uh, keep those handcuffs on you. This is a family affair. It's a family affair. You know, everybody plays a part. You know, everybody who's a part of the team is family. Even if they're friends, they have friends that's, that's turned into family. So, you know, it's a family affair. And, you know, we look good while doing it. That shit's so far when they be doing that shit. Closest thing to a perfect fight. I'm Ramon Matthews. I'm one of Devin's assistant trainers. Devin is a great guy. We got a great team. I say one of the best teams in the world that like I ever seen. So it's it's an honor for me to be here, and it's just an honor to see Devin grow. He's still growing, and I don't think people really understand. He's still getting better. Made his ass drop that bitch. Ha <laughs> ha. Hold that bitch, Nick. 
That's it. He can't hold it all. He can't hold his breath in the ball. <laughs> It did nothing, bro. Them short arms, what? Them short arms, you gonna feel them bitches. See, it's a difference between long and short arms, bro. Like, nigga don't know that shit. Nigga, them short arms, bro. He throwing short arms, bro. Them bitches hurt. Oh, God. Second one. Oh, God. Turn. There you go. There you go. Good job. Devin can stop anyone in this in or around the division, um, given the opportunity. Of course, he's, um, you know, he's uh, a pure master boxer. You know what I mean? So he's, he's aware of, of, of his surroundings in the ring at all times. Um, and can he put Ryan to sleep? Absolutely. Shit, anybody can put him, anybody can sleep, to be honest. At this stage of camp, you know, we're, we're comfortable, we're relaxed, we feel good around one another. Um, it feels like family. So uh, that makes it real easy for us. Uh, it's a good energy to be around. It's a good energy to be involved in. Everybody's excited. So for that, we're grateful. Um, but yeah, can't wait for April 20th. It's on. We're going to give him the same thing God gave an alligator. What do you give A bunch of nuts upside his mother head. Come on, champ. Let's go, baby. That nigga working, smiling, boy. Devin's never. Devin, it may be a little dangerous. I ain't going to lie. Gino Williams. I'm a speed and agility performance coach. Uh, I work on hand-eye coordination, building fast twitch muscle, and just getting athletes elusive. Keep working, keep working, keep working, keep working, Anton. Uh, ain't no plan. Um, his focus, he just pays attention to everything, like, perfect. Like, he, he'll ask questions like, how do you do this, how do you do this right? Like, and it just pushes me because, like, I see what it takes to get to the world champion level, and that's, that's what I'm trying to be. Little man gonna get there. That nigga starting early. Tell him DHP, we ain't no regular. We got the gang out here, man. We're in this mountain. Listen, I run this mountain, you get a helicopter for me. You feel me? There y'all go. How did I find myself in front of the camera? Hey, man. You know what I'm saying? It's episode four, bro. I'm interested to see this whole journey. I'm going to keep watching these motherfuckers until April 20th. And when April 20th comes, it's going to go down, bro. Only one man can prevail, nigga. Saying how hard Devin working and how he's smiling when he working. Man, this nigga looking dangerous, man. Ain't going to lie, Garcia. You ain't be old with my boy. This nigga is working his ass off. I don't know what you doing. But you ain't showing it, but God damn. This nigga working his ass off, man. For real.